Hello and welcome into the 3D. I got a question about how to install Qua Remesher for Autodesk Maya and today I will teach you how you can install Qua Remesher and where is the application plugins folder. First, we need to download the plugin and I will put the link in the descriptions for the website. In the main page, go under Qua Remesher, click on downloads and it will open a new page for us. This page simply explains that you can download the trial version of the Quart Remesher with 30 days of limit. And if you find it useful, later on you can get the full version of the plugin. Now type your email address in the box below and click submit. This will take us to another page. Fill the empty questions and press submit again. If you successfully complete the previous sections, you should see this message on your screen. Now, go to your email address, open the email and click on the validate account link. Once you click, it will open the downloads page for us. Simply find the best version for you and click download. As you can see, I already opened two different folders. The first one is the downloads folder which is where I downloaded the Quark Remesher. Right click on it and extract the files. Once you are done, go to your local disk C and open the program data folder. It may not be visible for you and this is where lots of my users had problem when they are trying to install Quark Remesher. What you need to do is click view on the top left corner and tick the hidden items box. Now we are able to see all the hidden folders. Click the program data folder, find and open the Autodesk folder and application plugins folder should be there. Finally, we just need to drag and drop the extracted files into this folder and open Maya. As you can see, Qua Remesher is already installed. To do a final test, I have created a cylinder and I broke the topology of the object with the Poly Remesh tool. Let's open the Qua Remesher and press the Remesh it button. Now, Qua Remesher is asking for license activation. Simply type your email address and press Start Trail. Trail version successfully activated. Press OK and press Remesh it button again. The result is not the best because I haven't played with the settings. But if you play with the settings, you can get some good results. If you like this tutorial and want to see more content on this channel, please comment down below and don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Once again, thanks for watching. I see you guys next time.